I first met Sharon when I was about uh, one year old. My parents left one day and they came back with this person I'd eventually be giving life advice to 30 years later. So please get comfortable, get some snacks, use a bathroom if you need, because for the next two to three hours, I'll be talking about Sharon and Matt. Sharon, while COVID brought the whole world to a screeching stop, it did not stop me from knowing and loving you. We became master chefs with the help of an air fryer like many people did. Sharon, Matt, they would like you to remember today's commitment. No matter how difficult things get in the future, whether it's 10, 20, or 30 years down the road. When things get tough, you can always look back to today and remember the commitment you're making. Pat, as we both know, I am probably one of the most indecisive people that you will ever meet. But despite all this, choosing to spend the rest of my life with you has been the easiest decision. There are just not enough hours in a day, minutes in an hour, or seconds in a minute to explain why I was so sure of this decision. Now in front of our family and friends, I promise that I will also stand by your side through all the ups and downs that life presents us with. You are my best friend, my life partner, and I love you. These things are simple. These things are true. Matt and Sharon, you two are really our pride. We're proud of you. Okay. Although usually they are usually in the United States, they are not in our midst. But every time we think about you, my mom will always hold up her hands. I'm very happy for you. We've been waiting for 30 years. One night while lying in bed, we somehow started talking about how men have lower life expectancy than women. <laughs> Out of nowhere, tears started to well up in your eyes. You made me promise to live longer than you so that you wouldn't be left by yourself. I made you that promise, but also had to quickly turn my back against you because I didn't want you to see under the dim light that there were tears in my eyes too. Sharon, on this special day, do you take Matt to be your lawfully wedded husband, to love and cherish from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health? If so, say I do. <laughs> I do. All right, awesome. Growing up, I always dreamed of having a sister. So it was a dream come true when I met Sharon one day at our eighth grade intergames class. Suddenly the guy who used all his student budget on street food now has someone to spend his time and heart on. Sharon, you made him the happiest I've ever seen before. to see how the two of you grow together as your next chapter unfolds. May your life together be as rich, as adventurous, as a recipe you love to explore together. Here's to a lifetime of love, laughter, and goofing around with you. By the power given to me 
by some crazy person who let me do this, <laughs> also known as Sharon. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. And now presenting Matt and Sharon. Everyone please stand up and greet the new couple.